Hey guys, hope everything is going well. So today I'll be talking about cross origin uh, resource sharing and uh, the error that you get, like what I have here. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to fetch data from my back end. And the I get this error saying um, access to fetch at this URL from origin um, localhost 3000, which is my front end have been blocked by cross policy. And this is very frustrating to fix if you don't really know, understand what's going on. But this is it, your browser is, uh, has this uh, in security policy called same origin policy. So is this like a security, security feature that allows um, the request made from the same domain name to be shared. And any request made outside this, um, the domain is going to be known as cross origin request, right? So my localhost 3000 is making a request to my backend, which is localhost 5000. So what I'm supposed to do and how to fix this is to come to my backend and make sure that I allow my front end to have access to requests and my back may, um, requests or responses that my backend would give to my clients, right? So the first thing you do is you have to install the NPM package course, right? And course means cross origin resource sharing. I think I said that already. Then the next thing I was supposed to do is, let me see, I think I have it here already. Yeah. So install the uh, type. So you do NPM install course. Then the next one is NPM install save dev type course. This is for, because I'm using TypeScript, right? So then I come here into my backend, import it from course, right? So I'm just going to use it as um, a middleware, right? So every on every response, it's a bit added to the header that the origin would be from localhost 3000. So I'll do course, Right, I can do origin. I can do this is for accepting any kind of allowing any kind of um, request from any domain, right? But I will specifically say for my localhost 3000, right? And then I can say credentials true, right? This to allow me when I do a post and a, an update, a patch, I'm sending credentials, right? So, so that's true. And I can also do this too. I can do methods allowed, right? So I can say, um, get, um, post and so on. Oh, methods, is it methods? Let me remove that. Mm, yeah, exactly. Right, I can say post, I can say get, but I don't specify what kind of methods are allowed. So it means if I do this, get and post, it means that I am only going to allow this URL or this domain name to only do a get and a post, and it can delete or update, right? By removing that, saving it. Then let's go back to here, right? And then refresh the page. Boom. Now it works. It's no longer an error. And that's how you do it. If you have any questions, let me know. I'm happy to help. Thank you guys and have a good day.